Hi everyone, today it's Capuchon Cutting Day again. I have a really nice piece of a purple blue pinfire uh, jeffanite that I'll be cutting today into an oval shape. Now this piece I'll be cutting today I don't expect will disappoint at all. It has a really nice purple sheen on blue with a lot of gold pinfire flecks. So I think it's going to turn out to be a really nice stone. If you haven't been here before and you do like this video, please subscribe, turn on your notifications. And if you've got any questions, just ask them down below and I would love to answer them. Now this is a really nice piece. You probably can't see it there, but it does have nice purpley sheen in there. And again, this will probably be an oval because uh, I want to keep as much as possible. But it will be a very nice piece, I believe. You can sort of see there's quite a lot in the sides. Hopefully we'll keep as much of that as possible. Okay, I'll just rough it up first of all. See, because it's dark up here, I'm not worried about grinding this away as long as I try and keep the brighter colours in the top. Square up the sides. Shapes a little bit out. Now just take some of this waste around the top off. Okay, I'll go and put that on a drop stick and then we'll come back. So we're just going to warm the stone up, make sure it's warm just so the wax will stick. Not too hot. And just straighten it up on the dop stick. So this I think is going to make a beautiful stone as long as I don't stuff it up. our shape put an angle on that Check our shape again. Just 
little bit of adjustment there, I think. Hold it there, you can see on the side there all that pin fire. Just want to make sure I don't lose all that. I'm going to lose some of it. This might be a high dome or reasonably high anyway. Camera stop shaking. We're going to be right. Oops, sorry, keep bumping the camera. Well, I think we've kept most of that pin fire. Just to need a little bit more smoothing. I think that's fine and we'll go on fire polish now in the kiln. Now it's out of the kiln and as I said before I didn't expect this would disappoint at all and it has turned out to be a very nice stone. Have a look at it. Tell me what you think in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. Don't forget, if you want to see a couple more videos, you'll find some suggested ones up the top and down the bottom. And uh, please don't forget to subscribe. And until the next video, I'll say bye for now.